Happy birthday to you. Hi. Welcome to my kitchen, which is really small, but it is a kitchen. And today I'm going to make a cake. I don't have a pan, unfortunately, that would fit this small oven here. And I don't want to use my big oven because there's a bunch of pots and stuff that I store in there. So I'm going to attempt to make a pan out of good old fashioned aluminum foil. I'm attempting to make a heart shaped thing. Or actually, should I make a heart shaped one? <laughs> Or should I just make a normal one and then cut it into a heart? I think I'll cut it into a heart because it's hard. My homemade pan. So the main ingredients you will need is, well first a bowl to put the stuff in. And I have here a measuring cup. I don't drink normal milk because soy milk lasts longer and I live by myself. So I usually don't drink that much milk. So I just use um, vanilla soy milk. Cake batter, butter eggs and thank god that i have just enough eggs i don't have a beater which sucks my mom does so just crack them eggs it says you once use one stick of butter but i don't think i'll do that because that's disgusting i'll use like a little bit a chunk a tablespoon i'm gonna put it in a little bowl and microwave it for like 20 seconds one fourth cup so I'm just going to soft or mix the butter more so it's melty. nice and mixed. Come on, baby. I just set this thing. Come here, kitty. For 30 minutes and God, it's chubby. He'll be a good little meal. <laughs> eat you hold it. I'm gonna fatten you and eat you. <laughs> um, I love my kitty. He just wanna my little baby. Just a little My little baby. Anyway, so I set it for 35 minutes and I'm gonna let it heat up and then I am going to put it in the oven. This is my kitty big. I raised him so well that he got so big. <laughs> Hi everyone! Say hello to So I finished baking the cake and it looks really good. It actually smells really good too, surprisingly. I am going to cut it into the shape of a heart. I am very proud of myself for making, for carving this shaped heart cake thing. So the hard part is I'm gonna have to transfer it into a plate. Kind of scared. I feel like this cake is really solid though. It's small so I can just peel it. Ta-da! This is a frosting. It's pretty and pink. I actually mixed two things. Decorating pink icing and this. The cream cheese frosting. Put a bunch of frosting. So here is the finished result and I am not done yet because as you all may know on a birthday cake you gotta put some lettering on it. 